Hey guys, what's up? It's Kyle from Kyle Raps here. And today, as you can see by the title and the notepad here, we are posting a status to Facebook. Now, this is a uh, pre-made text. If you do want this to uh, have only the user to be able to post without um, having pre-made text, I will tell you that later on in the tutorial. But let's get straight into it. So go ahead and open up Xcode here and create a new project. Select single view application and we're going to call this posting to whoops, Facebook. And we're going to run this on the iPhone for the device and, we'll be, and we will be using storyboards for the interface builder. Select next and create. Alright, first thing you need to do is go ahead and add two frameworks. Those two frameworks will be accounts, which should be right there. And we also need to add the social. And just select add there. So after you have both of those um, imported to your Xcode project, let's just go straight into the .h file. Go ahead and hashtag import the first one there, and then we're going to go accounts. Oh, I need my notepad open for you guys to follow along. Alright, that should be good enough for you guys. Alright, so we're going to just import accounts. Why isn't that loading up? Oh, that's why. Accounts slash, um, sorry, accounts forward slash accounts dot h, and then just go ahead and close it off. I thought we were doing the quotations there, so they're not quotations; they were actually uh, the greater or less sign. So again, go ahead and write import the second one, and we also need to import the social dot h file. Next, just go ahead and open up the curly braces, and inside those, just go ahead and write SL, and it should automatically pop up, SL Compose View Controller. Go ahead and write the star, and then my SL Composer Sheet, and then a semicolon. Now we also need an IB action to have the button uh, declare, well, have it in the .m to declare it. So go ahead and write uh, the dash bracket IB action right there. And we're just going to call this post posting to Facebook. And at the end of this, just write a semicolon. That's it for the .h file. Now we can go into the .m file. So just under the information there, uh, go ahead and write the dash bracket IB action and then just type post and it should automatically pop up. Delete all that and open up the curly braces. Now, this is where all the code's gonna go, so pay attention here. We'll go line by line. First, we're gonna go my SL compose. Wow, I actually spelled that wrong. Let's just put an O in there. Compose. -er. There we go. There. Composer sheet equals, and then just open up the two uh, square brackets there and write SL composer compose view controller, and then allocate. I think that is, and then close only one. And then in the next line, just write in it, and then close the other one as long as it's semicolon. Now the next line, here I'll just close that. Let's go ahead and write the exact same thing, sort of. Only this time we're going to open up one and write SL compose view controller, and then space compose, and it's right there. Already done for us basically. Now over here we're just going to write 
SL service type Facebook and then close that one bracket and a semicolon. In the next line here we're going to open up one of the square brackets and then write my SL compose composer sheet set initial text and then the at symbol and two quotations just close off that square bracket and a semicolon. Now in here um, you can write anything from like just place text here but say you don't want to actually write the text and you want the user to post the text or write it um, by themselves instead of this you can just write nil and it will automatically do that for you and you don't have to write any other more code just nil but we're gonna have that for this tutorial now on the next line we're just gonna go ahead and open up one square bracket and then type self and then present which should be right there right there but we're just gonna get rid of nothing no never mind alright now we're just gonna row my SL composer sheet animate it yes completion nil and of course the semicolon at the end and that is all the code we need for this tutorial. So let's go ahead into the main storyboard. We can now close off this, open up our sidebar here, and import a um, round rack button. We will just center that. We'll go ahead and change the size of the um, screen to 3.5 and center this again and we're gonna name this post to Facebook alright now that after that's done go ahead into the connections select view controller and then just drag posting to Facebook to the post to Facebook button select touch up inside and we're all good to run this in the iPhone simulator As you can see, we do have our post and Facebook button. We can just select that there. And we will get our nice uh, view controller with its animated pop-up. But of course, if you don't have your setting um, for the Facebook in the settings in the simulator, then you may want to do that. But also, if it's not on your phone for the devices that you're running, you're going to want to enter that in settings. So, after that's done, you can just post Facebook, and right after you have your thing pop, sorry, your thing entered in your device, you'll be all set to go for posting to Facebook. I hope this helped you in your Xcode project, guys. If you have any video suggestions, feel free to Skype me or um, contact me at the contact section of my website. You, so, you also have all source code at the website of this. It will be in the description, and I will no longer be having direct download to this project. It will only be the source code, so the video will be more helpful. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you had a great time doing this tutorial. Peace. Also, guys, don't forget to check out our website, www.kyroapps.weebly.com. Check us out on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter, and don't forget to download our awesome app. You can select the previous view, previous video to go to the previous video of our Xcode tutorials. And as always, don't forget to subscribe.